intraarticular hip injection using anatomic surface landmarks. The surface landmarks are the anterior superior iliac spine with a line drawn distally towards the knee. This is line 1. The second landmark is the greater trochanter with a line drawn anteriorly. This is line 2. These two intersect at point B, which is the target point. Then the entry point, point A, is done on an imaginary line drawn between the anterior superior iliac spine and the greater trochanter, shown here as the red dotted line. Point A is one third of the distance from the anterior superior iliac spine, which lies on the border of the gluteus medius, also known as the soft spot. Two to three milliliters of local anesthetic are injected at point A. An 18 to 20 gauge spinal needle is introduced at point A towards point B at approximately 30 degrees posterior direction. The needle passes through the capsule until bone is encountered. In this video, we use the C arm and a die to confirm the accuracy of this technique. After injecting 2 milliliters, a check image is taken which confirms intraarticular placement with the shape of the die being limited by the zona orbicularis. Then the rest of the fluid is injected into the joint and the needle is withdrawn. This technique shows that intraarticular hip injection can be done using anatomic surface landmarks with a high success rate. Potentially, this technique can be used in the outpatient clinic without radiological guidance. Thank you.